This isn't their first trip to the chapel, saying I do for the second time in 70 years. I pronounce you husband and wife. <laughs> <laughs> this time around, it's a different crowd gathered in the pews. Muriel and Robert Stoven's children, grandchildren, and great-grandchildren get to watch as the couple ties the knot once again. Oh, it's been overwhelming, overwhelming from the time I woke up in the morning and said to Bob, we've got to get up, we're getting married today. <laughs> the chance to get married again in the same church on the same day at the same time as their original wedding all those years ago. Even the smallest details could not be overlooked. The bride's necklace, an heirloom she last wore seven decades ago. The couple's family surprised the pair with a ceremony to celebrate their 70th wedding anniversary. Well, the ceremony just sort of emerged, I think, out of our true love and dedication to two people that have set an example for more than 65 years. The couple, now in their 90s, met through Muriel's brother, a close friend of the groom's. He used to go call on him, and she'd come to the door, and I think, get out of the way, I want to see your brother or not. <laughs> It's a good thing I failed. <laughs> After a two-year engagement, the rest is history. I said to Bob, uh, we should get married so we can be together for Christmas. And so he said, when I'm earning $75 a month, we'll get married. So we did. The wedding photos might look a little different, but the relationship that stemmed an entire life together is still going strong. So often now you say, well, people have to work at be their marriage. Bob and I have never felt that we had to work at it. It was always what we both wanted to do, was make each other happy. This is the moment. Leaving the ceremony to the sounds of the summer. Another sign that this romance isn't cooling off anytime soon. Caitlin Van Der Woosteen, CTV News, Regina. My heart singing.